Okay, what we have here is a, a cooling test going on. I've got all seven tubes in it right now. Running about 6.7 amps at 6 volts DC. It's a little over 40 watts of input. We've got uh, thermocouples on the uh, filament transformer, as well as a thermocouple on the uh, 6 Alpha Gulf 7. That's the, uh, metal, the metal oscillator tube. <clears throat> That's the uh, transformer temperature right there, and about 80 degrees. That's the uh, vacuum tube temperature. And the ambient, yeah, it's about that, 71.7. The issue we've had here is the uh, pass transistor. It's a little warm back here, so we we put an extra of the cooling duct. We did some tests earlier, trying to cool both. This is the uh, Heat sink for the filament transfer or the diode full bridge doesn't really need any extra cooling. But this one back here, that's the pass transistor under here. We're getting extra cooling from the uh, exhaust fan. So, and it's been running a little bit cooler. It was rubbing 95 degrees here a few minutes ago, but we put the extra cooling duct on it and modified that again a second time and made it even better. So it's it. It's running cooler. Yesterday it was running about 107 degrees after about an hour or so. We've been running about 40 minutes so far. So, <clears throat> and this is some of the uh, temperature readings we've been getting on it. This is temperature one is the uh, T3 transformer. It's our time. Temperature two is the vacuum tube. Temp 3 is the issue we've been having here. We started at 11.50. We're at about 12.30 uh, right now. So, went from 77 up to about 95. We've modified it. we put a little more blue tape on the bottom, so force more air on top of the uh, the fins. So, it uh, seems to be cooling a little bit better. We want to keep it as cool as possible. Keep that transistor as cool as possible. And, uh, go from there. So we're going to run this thing all day and uh, see how uh, well it performs. So there you have it.